Hello, welcome back. Last time I did some cleanup on some of the paradoxes that I had missed, and I think I got most of the Ublek conundrum done. Yeah, one remaining level here. Now, it has been claimed that there was a clue for, um, for paradoxable levels that I looked at and apparently said something about. After parsing through several comments that alluded this to this in some way, finally pieced together enough information to work out. Apparently it's in payload. I think I know what I'm looking for now. Uh, maybe it's that stuff up there. One 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 three three two two. I don't think that's what I'm looking for. And I I have no way to parse that as anything meaningful. Well, there's nothing in here. Okay, it's not what I thought. I did spot a thing that was a little bit clearer here in the Ublet conundrum. Uh, which level was it? Huh. Which level was it? I I just looked at it. Uh-oh. Okay, here we go. It was here in transfer, the last one that I did. Apparently this is supposed to be my clue. Uh, boy, good luck figuring out that that's what that re represents. And, like, I people told me payload, I guess it was the thing in the ceiling? But what that's supposed to mean, I have no idea. Okay, so... 5, 6... 11... 13 and, uh, no, 14 and 16. So here, and then these two, Enchanted Oubliettes, I'm supposed to paradox in? That sounds plausible, okay. So Enchant has, really, I can paradox here? How? Yeah, I can make a green chest out of this. And enter it. And then enter this, but... The problem is both of these chests point to the same place. I don't know how to paradox if I cannot remove... No, wait, that's fine. Yeah, no, no, it's not. What? So I need some new way to paradox here, apparently. Well, no, I only get one of these. I can only carry this into its... Yeah, if I want to enter this chest, then be able to move it around again, I'll just be in the same room. There's no edge to drop it off. Maybe... Oh, I have an idea. Hey, so here's a thing that I thought about doing when I was in here, but didn't actually fully commit to. Let's try it. This might be an entirely novel way to uh, cause a paradox. Uh, this won't work. I need that box. I hope this works the way I think it might. So yeah, working with... Once I have the box here... Working with the stuff in this room is not too hard. So at one point I wanted to throw the green chest up there and have it collide with... Let's see, I want to open the first door, have it collide with the second one, then exit from there and be placed inside a locked door on the level above. Yeah, that sounds like it could plausibly paradox me. It's the only way I can see to do anything resembling that in, uh, in this arrangement at least. So, um, where do I want the box? Not at this level, I want at least one level deeper. So I'm going to exit this level. So at this level I want an unlocked door and a box. Yeah, okay. So I'll embed once. Throw this up here. Take a key with me. Get this over here. Unlock the door. Yeah, this is a simple setup. Not hard to do when I know what I'm doing. Okay, put me inside that locked door. Hey, it worked! Okay, I guess that's how you do it. Neat. What are you? Well, okay. Oh, Ublek down there. Down there? So, picking up the blower is gonna reproduce it and blow the key up out of the room. I can't really get at the Ublek. There was nothing... Uh, well, I don't restart here, because I'll, I'll go back. I don't know why that first room existed. Like, why didn't I just start here in this room? I can't get back up to the... Or unless I bring a blower out. Here we go. So I've destroyed nothing in that room. Nothing is permanent. 
but what does this help me do exactly? So yes, do the- whoa, don't drop that down there. Do the usual thing of swap which chest is which. That made another one of those, which is not really what I want. This is another of these, so this is getting complicated. What do I want to do? I want a copy of this chest inside itself. No, why do I want that? No, I just need any chest up here. Okay, so... Who are you? You're that guy. Okay, so... If you're that guy... Wait, where am I? I'm confused. This one is... I think I just want the copy of this chest. So bring that forward in here. In here. Copy the... Well, hey, come back. Oh, problem. Yeah, that's a problem, all right. The problem is I want to be in here with this chest with that blower copied, and I can't accomplish that. Oh, but maybe I don't even need to do that, because watch this. Never mind the oobleck. It's just, it, it exists, but it doesn't really matter. So here's what I, I don't think this will work. No, not like I was thinking it might. Also, I'm not going to be able to get down from there. Oh, yeah, I need to bring the exit room here is what I need. So my plan was to go into this chest, come back out down and have the key reset, but the key doesn't reset. It's still up there. Okay, so I've messed up this puzzle. Hmm. I'm pretty sure. There's no way to win this race. Definitely. I've tried this before recently. It doesn't work. Without any permanence, though, what do I do? Hmm. Okay, so re-paradoxed. Let's think this through a little bit more before I commit to anything. So I have two chests that I can pick up here. That one's the exit room. Oh, okay, I do see something that I didn't see before. So I'll bring this back with me. Bring this back with me, sure. So I definitely want to bring the exit room into this chest. I need the exit room up there. Why do I think that, though? What good would that ever do me? And all I've, I haven't set up anything interesting here, really. Okay, so I have to figure out how to get that key down. Having... Oh. Oh, is it way, way simpler than I thought? It is. Oops, come back in there. Okay. I was trying to think of ways that I could... I don't know. I carried a different object than the blower in here, which allowed the oobleck not to make another blower, which didn't block the key, and since I have the exit chest, this is... Whoa. <laughs> I realized I had to make that throw on the way down, and fortunately was quick enough to do it. <laughs> if I didn't, I wouldn't have been able to jump there. Okay, neat. So it said this is also paradoxical? I see that there's a green chest. Oh, same way. Okay. I just had to learn that new method of paradoxing, I think. Yeah, same way, I'm pretty sure. Okay, so make another of this. Okay, you know, I'm going to have to remember how I solved this. That might be tricky. Or not. Yeah, again, same principle. So I've embedded once. Do I want to do it twice? I think once is enough, isn't it? Wait. Why did I even need to embed? Why would I... Oh, because I have to exit this. Right. Okay, so... Uh -huh. Bring this in here. No, bring this out here. Then carry the chest out. Carry the key out. And I'm in a place where I have access to both. And all I have to do is go into the chest, unlock this, throw the chest, exit the chest. Okay. Cool. Alright. Diamond is up there. There is a chest. If I touch anything, I'm going to lose my oobleck. Doesn't look as though I get a choice. Looks as though I need to have a choice, though. However, 
It also looks as though I could just do that. Oh, no, I can't carry this up there. I would be able to just do that and carry that up there and everything would be cool, but I can't make that jump. So, what's this? A way to get myself potentially stuck because there's no coming back from here. Is this itself? It is. Okay. Uh, I can't carry it into itself. Why do I want this? I see why. Uh, no, I don't. Well, at least that's really just a resetting mechanism. I know there's an achievement I haven't gotten for embedding into a chest a whole lot of times. Uh, I could just like keep going in in a place where I can go in if I wanted all the achievements, but I don't really care much about those. Um, I need... Wait a second. But I can like carry this out if I want. Okay, so here's how I can get a copy of this chest. That sounds maybe useful. So that's going to do that now. Which is okay, I think. Yeah, I think that's totally okay. Because what that lets me do... I can use this blower to place two blowers up here, basically. I think. Wait, but I only needed one of... How did I end up with two? Because the oobleck at this level duplicated it. Got it. Okay. Anyway, so I go in here. I'm going to take this. And turn it into a blower. Neat. Let's do that again. Uh, if you would let me on onto the ground, please. <laughs> Used to sit there. Yeah. <laughs> you sit there. And I'm going to make another of you. Uh, uh, there we go. Cool. Simple paradox. Okay, so uh, I know I can paradox in this level based on that map that I found. Uh, I could just do this now. Let's actually go back. I did have some people tell me about the locations of where I can paradox. Let me just see if this lines up with my understanding. So in the dungeon, I'm supposed to be able to do it in sluice. Okay. Uh... So that would be three here. So what was the clue? Like, zero, zero. Is there something outside Woodland? What was Woodland? Okay, so first one, zero, zero, zero. Zero, zero, zero. Three, three, two, two, was it? Was it in here? Yeah, zero, 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 three, three, two, two. So yeah, this is one of those clues that, like, I am having enough trouble understanding it, even applying it retroactively. <laughs> I, I get, I think, I get what it refers to. So there are zero paradoxes in the first three. This is number two, this is number three, this is four. There are three here, three here, two here, and two here. So I can verify whether I found all the ones here. I have found all of those. It doesn't give me exact locations like the Ublek conundrum. So two places in the temple, supposedly. Those were twos, right? I think. Uh, I'm told I can do it in clasp. But didn't that say two? Am I misinterpreting the thing? Three in the ruins. I've gotten three. Three in the dungeon. If sluice also does it, then that would be three. So am I missing one in the temple and nobody told me about it, maybe? Oops, not you. If I understand what this clue says, making a huge amount of leaps in logic here, though. Yeah, so it says there are two in the temple. All right, one of them is supposed to be clasp. Uh, and the one in the dungeon is sluice. Okay, let's do sluice first. Where are you? Down here, down here. So sure, it does have a green chest that goes to itself. Oh, I, I understand, okay. So the idea is you squish it behind that block. Okay. Do I have enough entries to do this? Oh, yeah, that was enough. Neat. Of course. I can't exit a chest that's inside a solid object. Oh. That doesn't make sense. Why would I ever think that would work? <laughs> okay, so uh, that was supposed to be my clue for how to do... Ah, oh, rude! 
I hope those both contain blowers, because otherwise I can't get back. <laughs> uh, that was supposed to be my clue for um, how to do that in the other places. I just figured out how to do it. So, okay, that one contains a blower at least. Gonna use this to merge these two chests together, because that'll just make everything more convenient. Probably. Unless these lead to the same place, that's possible. Alright, so who are you? They are the same room, aren't they? Ah, but it's top level, so this is the only way I can get the same chest into into itself. Okay. So we got the same chest in itself. Uh, this is another sort of case where I'm going to do something like this, right? So I have two blowers. But I have to get up and then back down. I don't think this is right. Well, I have two blowers out here now. No, I don't. I, I take it the other way. Okay. Like this. Okay, I have two blowers. Hmm. So this is cool, but... I cannot... Uh, okay, so I see what I have to do here. I have to bring both the chest and a blower along, because if I don't, I'll be stuck without a blower in a place where I can't get a new one. Wait, but no, I have... I need another blower still? Okay, sure. Now I'll get another. I think I'm thinking about this right. So that one has to blow stuff. This should just toss up there. Chest needs to, to, to come with me. Oh, come on now. Ah, juggling. Okay, chest first, then blower. So with these tools, uh, I can't bring two objects with me at a time. What am I thinking? I don't need to. Okay, I was thinking about it wrong. Okay. Simple stuff. Okay, well that's done. Uh, so in the temple... Clasp was the one that was pointed out to me. Okay, so green chest again. Seems smart to do this, just in case. I have a jar, so I can bring the chest into itself. Ah, and same setup with the, uh, with the, the stuff, um, the, uh, the thing, you know, the thing, uh, the doors, the locked doors, doing stuff to themselves. Uh, this is a problem. I don't remember how I solved this the first time. Let's... Uh, let's leave those keys there. Well, how's that going to help me? I only need one key to Paradox. I don't have to solve this fully. But I need that chest in itself. Okay, so I need to do this. That's in the... Oops. That's fine. Oh, and that's what I was supposed to do anyway, to solve it. Uh, but I need to... No, I do need another key in there. How will that happen? Hold on. I wanted to not unlock that. Okay, so just leave that key there. I don't need that key. Uh, I did it wrong again. Okay, key in here. Don't unlock. Jar the chest into itself. Bring the key into the chest. Uh, and a... No, bring the key into the chest. Unlock this. I didn't need that extra layer, did I? I'm gonna unlock, jump in, move... No wonder I didn't find these. It just... Oops, I didn't want to move. Okay, so I, I did need what I, what I did. Uh, no wonder I didn't find these. I just did not know this method of paradoxing. Okay. I don't know what I was expecting. I can't exit a chest that's jammed in a door. <laughs> All right. So here's what's going on. Box, door, key, diamond. Not quite accessible blower. I mean, I can get back to it, yes. But so what? I can't bring the chest back to it. That's too high. Oh, but I can get another box. There we go. Uh, bring the chest back. Bring the blower in. And it's going to vent everything up this hole, including the key. Oh, is that it? That is it. Okay. Very simple one. Uh, 
right? Because I can get back up here. Hey, you didn't... Oh, key, you didn't ascend. Aw. So, there's something... Oh, I see what I gotta do. <laughs> That's silly. Alright, so how did I do this? Key here. Jar. Out. Ch uh, no, I, I keep... I, I always do the first step wrong. Leave key. Jar chest to itself. Enter with key. Unlock, move chest, exit. There. Simple steps, just gotta remember what they are. Get two boxes. Get chest to blower, get blower to chest. Blower goes here. There's a reason that's the, there's another gap up there. That one down there is so that I can fail and uh, see what I've done wrong. Uh, no, I still have a problem here. Oh, isn't that silly? Okay, I see what to do. All right, so let's do this right this time. Bring key in. It's a very short set of steps. Just, just do it right. Okay, do this, do this, do this, do this. Unlock, move, exit. There, that's how you do it. And now I forgot what I was going to do here. Oh yeah, that's right. So I don't build a tower of boxes. I can only have one in that room, of course. What I do is I put the key on the box, down in the pit. And that will elevate it enough so that the key can be blown upward. So this is one of those puzzles that's solved with platforming, kind of. So, uh, wait. Oh yeah, yeah, that still works. So box goes there, in the center. Blower goes here so I can ascend. Key gets thrown that way. Key gets thrown that way a few times until it works. There we go. Then it can be blown. Okay. Cool. I was a little worried for a moment that blower was too far to the right, but that worked. Okay, well let me just see if there are any other green chests here that I might be able to paradox with, since it said two, I was only shown this one, so maybe there's another somewhere. Okay, I looked through all the levels. Blister was the only other one that I could find that had a green chest in it. And now that I see that name, I remember somebody did mention this to me. I just didn't write it down in my notes. So that's my fault with the bad note taking. Okay, I see how to do this. Get you wet, jump in you. Uh, no. That's fine. So jar this out. Move that there. Then X. It to enter the jar? No, wait, hang on. So I need... Oops. I need a jar of air. Yes, I need a jar of air. Oh, yeah, I remember this silly puzzle. Uh, this is complicated. Right, I need a jar of air. So I have to actually partially solve this puzzle again to actually get back to where I want to be. So if that's there... Okay, so this is how I get a jar of air. Okay, so just just put it there. Got a jar of air. Uh, sure, I can toss that over there. That's fine. Why I want a jar of air? Because I want to take it into this while it's wet. And then use it to dry the place. No, I need another entrance. Do I? Uh, I don't know. Okay, so hang on. What's what's my stack right now? This is the top of it. Okay, so at the top level, I have an entry into the wet chest. I need an entry into the dry chest. No, I need an entry into the wet chest. Yeah, okay. I need to exit when the chest is there, to the just to the right of me. So I need to exit to wet. That's fine. Let's just encode one of these. Then I'll take this into the jar. In the dry jar, I place it here. Exit the jar, then exit the chest that doesn't exist anymore. There we go. That's how you do it. Now there's a suspiciously empty room with just a chest in it that I probably want to get somehow. I wonder how many of these unconstructed spaces there are. <laughs> this one took some effort to get into. It did, you're right. 
I guess, I think this is the last one. Unless there are some in the last tapestry. But I think, oh, and also the last one of the Ublet conundrum that I haven't been to yet. What are you? Ah, back to the beginning, I see. However, back to the beginning means that it's, it's a one way back there. So I'd rather take this out here. Why would I rather do that? I don't know. It gets this in here. Wait, that's not what I want. That's not useful at all. Oh. So now I just have two copies of this chest. That's not good for anybody. If you're green... And that means... I need to carry the blower through an exit that will take me up to this ledge. So that means I need to bring a chest that contains this room. It's not this one, it's that one up there. Is it that one up there? No, that one up there is the same thing as I already have. Hmm. I have some problems with how one way this is. That's the obvious contradiction. So if... So this is the, the exit room. These are the same thing, right? No, they're not. No, so I have the exit room here. Wait, I'm confused. This is this. <sighs> if only these chests were just labeled. I need to get that particular chest that I just jumped into into itself. But the only one of that that exists is in that room that's a one way to get up. So do I need to blower my way up that room? I don't think I can do that. Oh, but maybe I can. Oh, uh, uh, no. Whoops. Why did I have that button mapped to that? Okay, that's surprising. Uh, just pressing random buttons on my controller, as if it'll help. <laughs> this doesn't help me. It's just a one way in here. I haven't destroyed anything yet. And I can bring this down here, so that I can access it without the blower, if I really want to for some reason. I can make more than one of these if I really want to for some reason. These are all... That's one of those. But I can only have one of these at a time, it seems. That's my problem. I need two of these at a time, I think? Why do I think that? Because, again, I need an exit from up on that ledge... Uh, uh, because, yeah, okay, so, sure, I'll, I'll try this. This is fairly non-destructive, I think. So I can get onto that ledge, I can go into this chest. But the problem is that doesn't set up an exitable point because I can't get back down through that. And all it does is moves me further in. So I want that chest that's out there, and I want two of it. And I want it to be the thing I bring up onto the ledge. That would be all that I would need. But I can't have it. So my suspicion... My suspicion... Oh, I think I get it. Yeah, okay, this is silly. Uh, so let's bring this... No, no, not there. Here, I guess. So I'll bring this here, put it there take who, where, you are, the exit room. Okay, so I need you to come in here with me. This won't help, will it? I'm thinking no. Hold on. So, okay, I had some plan that involved something I can't do. From here, I can, like, 
take the blower in. There's a thing I can do to shuffle that chest through that room somehow and get two copies of it. Somehow. I'm not quite seeing it in my head yet how it would work though. So on some level above me, I do have... Uh, the egg, an, an, an extra exit chest. Like, I can go back one more. Oh. Okay. So, let me go back as far as I can. Again, I think this is non-destructive. Oh, shoot, I'm wrong. Okay, gotta restart. Okay, that does take some effort to get into. So, I'm pretty sure the solution at some point involves dropping a chest down through this. Then using the blower to push it... Uh, no, that doesn't make any sense, does it? So, if, uh, if, I, if I take this out here, and I take this with me... No, at no point did I have the exit chest... Okay, right, so I, I, I would drop this down there, and it would be inaccessible. So let's do this in another... What? Ah. That's the top level. I can come back to the top level. Ah, oh, this is so hard to think about. So this is the exit chest. This is the one I want two of. The only place where it exists again is inside this chest that's in my hands. I have to go up to get to it. There is no ever exiting out of here, so if I were to drop the exit chest down, I could only go deeper in. I can't come back to get it ever. No, that doesn't help. Yeah, that's one way. That is strictly one way upward, as for me, not for objects. But I'm the one who matters. But why do I have to enter the exit chest to get there? Right, the problem is my that I can't make those jumps otherwise. Because this thing in my hand I want to bring up there. That's, that's the, there are two of the same chest in this room right now. This is one of them, that's the other one. Somehow with the blower. Okay. Somehow with the blower. I almost see I keep I keep getting this dim vision of something that I can do. Like I can go in here. I can blower this up to up to the next ledge. But then I can't take the blower into it. All I can do is exit here. Also, it's a little hard. If, if I jump here, I'll end up up there. I'd like to have something in my hand so I could... I, yeah, entering a chest on this ledge is not possible unless I have... Well, is that true? Yeah. Seems to be. Not possible unless I have something in my hand. And I... How would that help me? I have... I have some idea of how this will go. I just, I can't put it together while I'm talking, apparently, so give me a second. Okay, I got it. I fiddled around for a while until I worked out the magic. It wasn't quite like I was expecting, but it was kind of similar, only more complicated. So, uh, I used the blower to get this chest down. Oh boy, can I remember what I did? I need to bring this out here. Okay, so I have access to both of these chests. Basically, I ferry these two chests with me all the way through another trip through this room. Kind of. So I'm going to take this one in here. I think this is what I want. Yeah, so now I enter the exit room. I use this to get another transition room chest. Uh, out here. And since I'm exiting, that will stick around. So I exit to this point. That's the important bit. Then I can carry as many objects out as I want. So I have the blower here. I use it to ferry these two chests up here. There was a tricky little platforming move that I had to learn to make this all work. 
which is kind of neat. Okay, so which chest is which? Is this the exit room chest? Yeah, okay, that's not the one I want yet. That's the one I just want to bring upwards. So here's how you enter a chest on this ledge. Jump throw down. <laughs> so that I can jump low. Then I can come in here, get this blower, and take this, the exit chest, to the other exit chest. Uh-oh, I need the blower. That's okay. I can get the blower. I just need to have these inside each other. No, I did it wrong. I needed to bring that chest with me because now I can't get to that one. Uh, is that true? Yeah, this is the wrong kind of chest for that. Okay. So I had to learn this process. It takes a little bit. I have to go into this once to make a jar spot. That's the step I keep forgetting. Make it wet so I can carry it up here. Hey, no, no, don't do that. Uh, I want to exit to dry. Take a dry jar. Toss the dry jar down. Put this in the no, no, not the jar. Shoot. <laughs> Try again. Okay, enter once. Enter wet. Uh, bring up there. Exit to dry. You go there. Take a dry jar. Toss down there. Bring jar into this twice. It needs to specifically be twice because the first exit will be out of the jar. So then I enter the jar. There are no, it only needs to be once. I was mistaken, I think. No, but that, that exit needed to be wet, so yeah, it needed to be twice. Anyway, right, so I'm here. Do this. Get that. I don't know why I moved that left, just so I can get down easier, I guess. Then swap these. So now I have an exit chest in my hand. That looks wrong. It's right, though. It's not wrong. So I got the other kind of chest in my hand. Over here. Bring the blower. So exit chest is the one on the right. I don't want to enter it just yet. I want it to just sit here. The chest of this room is this one. I do want to enter that one, like that, to bring the blower up here. Now I just need both of these chests to sort of come upward with me. Like this. That works just fine. So I have two copies of exit, one copy of this room. I should just, right now, go get this blower. Bring it into this one exit. Go get the other exit. Alright, so what I was saying was that I need an entry into this room encoded right here. Done. I bring the blower with me, exit to that ledge, and I got it. Cool! Okay. That was kind of complicated, both in the access and in the, the actual puzzle. All right, achievement, Diamond Jubilee. That means I got all of them. Uh, I don't know if that just covers the original level sets or if that includes these two. It does not include these two because I don't have this one. Okay, so that was all the original diamonds, but there are more to find here. There's one more to find here, and there may be more in the last tapestry. So I guess I'll kind of try to watch out for anything that doesn't seem like it's part of the normal tile set, just in case it's a clue for where diamonds are in here. Assuming there are diamonds in here. Seems pretty likely. There's this many levels. Surely there's a green chest at some point. <laughs> okay, cool. So just had to learn a new way of paradoxing and new way of reading the... It is interesting that every single one of the paradoxes I missed used that method, the method of obstructing the chest. And that was why I didn't find any of those others. I probably would have found all of them if I knew that method. All right, cool. This music sounds unfamiliar. Have I heard this before? No. Okay, there's new music. Is it just in the last tapestry? Last time I came in there, I commented the music was different too. <laughs> all right, anyway, uh, next time, last thing in the Ublet conundrum, then all the rest of these. I'll see you then.